Hello and welcome to Ragsville Creek Workshop. My name's Anthony and this is part two of the uh, tailstock die and tap holder uh, attachment. And uh, I hope y'all enjoy it. If you do, hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. And if you want to be notified every time I put up a new video, uh, hit the little bell there. Uh, and tell your friends about us uh, if you like our content, because 99% of it's going to be machining. So with no further ado, let's get into part two. Thank y'all for stopping by, and God bless. We over at the bench now. We got it uh, re-threaded and put in there, and uh, where it'll work, it's not uh, half inch 20, uh, but uh, oh well, we... Uh, we may do, and uh, this is the this is the result here. This is the uh, shaft right, right here. Let's see. Let's get out of here. Uh, this is the shaft here. Uh, I don't know if that's uh, uh, this is a five eighths, and this is the uh, MP two. That's the only one I had. I've got an adapter that goes from MP2 to 3, so I said, I'm going to put an adapter on this. I didn't want to buy another one right now until I see how this is going to work, and then I'll buy uh, MP3 to put here. But uh, may or may not, may just use the adapter. Uh, but uh, this is the uh, die holder. It's going to sit on here and uh, spin. It's a little little tight right now but this this uh piece of uh needs a, a little bit of polishing right here it's uh it's got some old uh, rust looking spots on it uh but that looks like it's gonna work just fine for holding on to that uh i'm gonna uh, drill and tap and put a little handle on here that's uh kind of short where it don't hit the ways but uh that uh, I'll hold on to it here until uh, it slips out of my hand, and then we'll uh, you can use that, and it won't uh, do nothing because it won't I'll make it short enough where it won't. Uh, I mean, it won't damage nothing. I'll make it short enough where it don't hit nothing. But that's uh, that's it so far. Now we got to make the little adapters to all to go here, uh, and uh, we're going to uh, have this where it holds taps up to a half inch. And uh, uh, all of our metric and uh, uh, SAE dies that we got in the imported set. Uh, again, it's imported. I can't afford the uh, <clears throat> the green uh, green filler uh, American-made tap sets. They just uh, too expensive for just a hobby shop. So. Uh, We'll get to making them, and uh, we'll uh, we'll film that for y'all too. Uh. Okay, we're gonna make the die holders now and uh, see what we can come up with on them. <laughs> All right, we got a turn of 800 
foot on this diameter uh, seven hundred thousandths long. So let's uh, put us a witness line here at seven hundred. And <clears throat> put her stop up here. All right, I'll get this down a little closer and I'll uh, bring y'all back. Okay, we're gonna finish this up. It's uh, I had to let it cool off. It was uh, it was real hot. See what it is now. We took a, we just took two off. Uh, Got to have uh, four more. Okay, we're turning the other side now. And uh, we flipped it around. And we're getting close to the end of 941. We want an 805, so we got another 100 here we can take off. I'm going to get it within about five, and then I'm going to let it cool off. And the other side did the did the same thing, and uh, I did the same thing to it. I'm hoping it'll be about between 8:10 and 8:15. That way, ah, uh, yeah, 8:11 three tenths. That's good. Okay, now we're going to drill the holes in it. Well, let's go ahead and turn this diameter here.
this is the other end for a different size die holder. Uh, we've got the uh, spud turned down to within a few thousands. We'll finish all of the all of that up after we get the hole drilled. This is the other end for a different size die holder. Uh, we've got the uh, spud turned down to within a few thousands. We'll finish all of the all of that up after we get the holes drilled.